right, so today I'm at the Fiddlers Free in Gateshead to take on their brand new undefeated mixed grill challenge. I've honestly got no idea how big this thing is, other than it's got a 10 ounce steak, 10 ounce gammon, like a chicken breast, sausages, all of the usual stuff on a mixed grill. So I guess the only, only way to find out how big it is is to head inside and take this thing down. All right, so here it is, the Mixed Grill Challenge here at the Fiddler's Free. I'll be honest, it's not as big as I thought it was going to be, so that's quite a, a good thing. It should go down nice and fast. But yeah, basically we've got a Cajun chicken breast, we've got some onion rings, we've got two fried eggs, we've got 10 ounces of gamut, a 10 ounce steak, we've got some sausages, I think there's two sausages, there's mushrooms under there, some thick cut chips, we've got a whole vine of tomatoes. Um, yeah, you get 30 minutes to do it. If you do it in 30 minutes, you get a free pint. But I've been promised a free dessert if I can finish it, so I'm going for the free dessert. All right, in three, two, one, time is gone. All right, my friends, so welcome back to another video. I'm honestly going to start getting a reputation for taking on the smallest challenges Britain has to offer. It's not good. Honestly, I came into this thinking it was going to be so much bigger, similar to the, uh, the chip butty. I came into this thinking it was going to be somewhat of a challenge, and then uh, when they finally brought it out, I was like, mm. I definitely should have ordered two. So before I get all the comments from you guys going, well why didn't you order two, it's not really a challenge. I didn't order two because I didn't know how big it was going to be. I honestly thought it was going to be pretty big. And then obviously when they brought it out I was like, I was very disappointed. It's basically a large mixed grill. I would say this is, this isn't really a challenge, this is a meal. I'd say the average guy can take this down. This is not, this is not a challenge, this is not big. Hence why it turned into more of kind of a speed challenge. But yeah, basically for the challenge, you do get 30 minutes to do it. It, it is a pay-to-play, which means no matter the outcome, you do have to pay for it, whether you win or lose, and it is £25. Right, that's the steak, sausages, mushrooms down in just over a minute. And uh, yeah, it basically consists of, a, I think it's around a 10-ounce steak. I don't think it was quite 10 ounces, I'll be honest. It wasn't there. Uh, wasn't the biggest. You get some gammon, you get two sausages, you get a Cajun chicken breast, you get two onion rings, two fried eggs, a vine of tomatoes, you get literally like two mushrooms, there's hardly any mushrooms there. You get some, I think it's like triple cooked chips, which were really, really nice. We'll get to them shortly. Uh, I think that's pretty much the, the contents of the challenge, to be honest. I don't really think there was anything else on it. And like I say, this thing, on the menu, there was actually meant to be a few more things. I believe it was meant to be belly pork and also black pudding. But I don't know if they just didn't have them in the kitchen or they forgot them, but they were not on the challenge. I'm painting quite a bad picture here, but I've got to say, the food here is amazing. It's proper home-cooked food. You can tell that just by looking at it. The steak was cooked absolutely perfect. I asked for it rare, it came out rare. Unlike the, uh, the steak fondue challenge that I did recently. But overall, this generally, it's, um, it's definitely the thing that an average person can do. So if you want to get your first win, or you want to just try out a challenge, or a quote-unquote challenge then I'd definitely give it a go because the food is generally amazing you're not gonna have a problem with the taste or the textures or anything it is generally spot on but my friends with that said I'm gonna leave you to enjoy the rest of this video maybe I fail it who knows maybe I can't finish all of this uh, all of this food <laughs> anyway guys make sure to keep watching and find out with that said I will catch you in the next video
5 minutes 40. <laughs> that was nice. <laughs> <laughs> in hindsight, I probably should have ordered two, but I didn't know what the size was going to be. Similar to the uh, chip butty challenge that I recently did. But that was delicious. The steak was cooked perfectly. Now, I think it's time for that dessert I was promised. <laughs> Apple crumble and custard. <laughs> 